Okay, so, I'm very sick, and, yeah, uh, I did not go DVD shopping yesterday. What happened was, was that I needed to, uh, I looked online to see what movies, the couple movies I was going to pick up if I did go shopping, and my mum went to go pick them up for me while I was at home sick, because uh, I mean, I was chucking up so much. I do feel a bit better today, uh, I can walk, you know, I can... You know, my stomach is a bit better, you know. I've taken some medication, which has kind of helped. Uh, so, yeah, uh, feeling a bit better. So, yeah, um, I, did en I did end up getting getting three movies. Three, not six. Um, one of them is for my brother, kind of, pretty much, but I still liked it. And uh, that's the movie that we're going to start off with. Ice Age Collision Course. Uh, this is a good film... Look, it's not like Zootopia where it has a deeper meaning. It, you know, teaches. You know, it's it's not it's not targeted to a, as to adults at all. Like Zootopia is also fun for the adults, and you know that 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 movie. You know, actually did teach kids a lesson. You know about you know violence, and it it just it just had some good messages. This movie does not have good messages. This is just to make kids laugh. Um, slapstick it also does include a bonus disc and that bonus disc has well I'll open, it, I'll open it up so we have ice age collision course on that disc and also also we have a little ice age short film called ice age a mammoth christmas which is you know goes for about 25 minutes i'm pretty sure yeah so yeah when i when I, my mum when I, she when my mum you know when i was looking online sorry um I actually didn't know it did include the bonus disc, uh, so I was kind of surprised when my mum brought it home. But yeah, it's it's kind it's pretty cool. Again, just this movie was just to make kids laugh. So I, I kind of did think it was funny. You know, people thought it was stupid, and it was just you know there was no, there was no real you know, there was no real there was no real reason to make this film. And I get that there was no reason. I guess it was to just put butts in seats and make some money. But I still liked it for what it was, and it was just a just a, a film to make kids laugh, and just a bunch of slapstick. So, yeah, I like these Ice Age movies for what they are, and I liked this one. My least favorite of the Ice Age movies is either is either um it's, it's probably Confidential Drift, whatever it's called. Conf I don't know. I don't know how to say it. But the fourth one, the one that came before Collision Course. My two favourites are probably three and number two. So two and three probably probably my favourite ones, especially number three. But yeah, this one was still a good Ice Age film. Then we go on to a film. These two films were for me, and I have not seen it. I have not seen any of these films yet. But uh, we're gonna go straight on to The Purge Election Year. Uh, really interested in seeing this. I have seen number one. Have. And I, but I haven't got number one. I've I've got number two, but haven't seen it. And now I have this one, and of course haven't seen it. But I'm really interested because I saw I saw the trailer, really cool. Um, and I did like number one for what it was. It was a cheap. They could have done a lot more with the plot, but for the most part, I liked it for what it was. And it was a a cheap, you know, slasher flick. Yeah, just a, just a just a little slasher flick to you know get some horror fans to have some fun, and hopefully I, I'm not that's that's what this delivers as well because I'm not I'm not gonna watch this and I'm not gonna put this on and go oh yeah this is gonna be an absolutely amazing film. I'm just gonna say to myself this is gonna be a, it's gonna be a film with bad dialogue, bad you know dumb characters which you don't care about. The only thing you care about in this movie is probably all the blood and the violence and stuff. I, I'm not expecting to care about any of the characters in this movie. I'm just expecting to have some fun, which hopefully I get. Uh, again, I, I really like this cover design. It's a really cool cover. I got the Statue of Liberty girl right there. Um, I, I did show you Anarchy uh, in my other other DVD update video. Um, I think it was like two DVD update videos um, ago, and I was gonna get the three pack, 
you know, that includes all three movies, but like I said, uh, I got that one in a little horror package, so uh, I had to cancel my order for, I had to cancel my order for the three pack, and I just got this one in the end. So yeah, the bonus features, deleted scenes inside the purge and character spotlight. The spotlight is on Leo, which is Frank Grillo's character. Uh, but yeah, no bonus discs, discs or anything. Yeah, the purge election, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Looks like a bit of a cool slasher flick. Hopefully I get what I want and what I want is a fun horror movie time. So yeah. Then we go on to this really cool thing. I have not seen this movie, heard really bad things, but hopefully it's good. Because, you know, usually with me, like, people say movies are terrible, they're freaking stupid, but then I end up coming out saying, oh, it was the best movie I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> yeah, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't go too harsh on my movies. So, and uh, what I've got here is the Independence Day Steelbook. Uh, you need a bit of light on it. Yeah, I always do that when it's a still book, just to prove that it is a still book. Um, but yeah, really looking forward to this one. I love the back. It's a really cool uh, back. But yeah, I love this design. I was originally just going to get the normal Blu-ray with the slip cover, but I ended up getting this because I just love this design, man. This is great. And surprisingly, unlike any of the other still books I have. It's only one disc. So that's alright. It just includes the Blu-ray, not the Blu-ray 3D or anything. Just the average Blu-ray. I've heard it's a bit of a funny movie, you know. It's an, I've heard, it's heard, I heard it's a bit dumb, you know. Of course it's going to be dumb. It's Independence Day. But I, I, I don't have much interest. But I watched the trailer recently and I was like, alright, I'll give it a shot. I guess it could be a cool movie. Um... You know, I've, the, the visual effects look alright. And again, love this design. Really cool. And I love the back of it. Really cool back. So yeah. Um, I have not seen the first Independence Day. But I, I, I know a lot about it. You know, it's not like I'm coming into the Independence Day. Um, you know... I'm just going to say franchise, even though it's not really a franchise. It's not really, I'm, I'm not really coming into this franchise with a complete open mind, you know. I know what I'm, I know what I'm, I kind of know what I'm going to get. But I'm, I still am looking forward to it. Um, the Tarzan still book was a bit more rough than this still book, you know, with the front. Like, this one's kind of more, you know, comfortable to feel, you know. <sighs> but, um... Yeah, this one's still. I love the steel book, and yeah, hopefully it's good. Cause you know, I, you just, I just hate it when like you have a really cool cover design for a movie, and you end up hating the movie. So it kind of sucks when that happens. But hopefully, I like this film uh, for what it is, and that's probably a cool when it comes to visual effects film that that has bad dialogue. Kind of a science fiction version of the Purge Election Year. Just a, just a dumb little film, bad dialogue, but still some fun. So yeah, Independence Day Resurgence, still book. I'm glad I got it. I'm glad I got it. Really, really cool. But yeah, guys, let's recap. There's not much to recap here. First, we had Ice Age Collision Course and also a bonus disc that includes a, ver a Mammoth Christmas DVD. Yeah. <laughs> Then we have the Purge election year, which I am not expecting to be that great, but hopefully I get a cool dumb slasher flick. Then we have the Independence Day Resurgence Steelbook, which is kind of, hopefully is kind of like a science fiction version of this dumb little movie, but still kind of cool. But yeah, those are the films. I, well, my mum my picked up, but, yeah, these are the films that I just showed you. We have Ice Age Collision, Ice Age, sorry, Ice Age Collision Course, uh, The Purge Election Year, and Independence Day Resurgence Steelbook. So, I'm sorry you guys did not, you guys did not get a uh, DVD shopping video. 
I'll make sure to do one next week because I, I highly doubt I'll still be I'll, I, I highly doubt I'll still be sick next Thursday. But it it is possible, but very unlikely. But yeah, thank you for watching this video, everyone. Uh, and yeah, see you all later.